So we are in the highlights menu at the moment and we try to trim our clips. So to mark the highlights of a, let's say, longer source file. So you have a file that lasts 10 or more minutes and uh, you want to clip it. The normal process is that you go on the plus file and you see already it's quite small here and you can define, uh, uh, let's say, the scene length for about 1 minute and 40 seconds. But if the scene or the clip or the mark you want to do is quite smaller, it's getting heavy to find the right position, you know. So let's say I, I, I simply want to grab his hands here. It's, it's uh, necessary for me now to zoom in and you can do this by simply clicking on this button here and keep the click for at least let's say one or two seconds and then release it again. And now you can go exactly where the frame is to start your mark or to start your highlight. And I wanted to start the highlight when the moving is coming down here. Perfect, it's done. And it's, uh, it's for me perfect. So this is the starting point of the video. I press the loop button, it's moving back and I can do, of course, a uh, rough cutting here. So let's go back and back and back and back and now I'm going to click again, hold the click, it's going to zoom in and now I can grab exactly the position I want to have and this is just simply when he's playing the piano here. So now I have it. To zoom out I can press the loop button or I can press somewhere around the video but not in the video and you see it's automatically marked now. In this view the marker is or, or the marked scene is quite small so therefore the zoom functionality is a big advantage and great help uh, while you're working and clipping and marking all the highlights in your scenes. So I wish you happy clipping and if you have any questions just drop us a message.